This is a video on how to install Minecraft for Education on a Chromebook. The first thing that you'll want to do is click down here on your apps launcher. It looks like a little circle in the bottom left hand corner. I'm going to click there and I'm going to press on this up arrow. The next thing that you're going to do is locate the Play Store. The Play Store looks like this. If you don't see it on your first page, you may need to scroll through other pages to find it. Click on the plane store and type the word Minecraft. After you do that, you will see this icon appear, Minecraft Education Edition. You're going to click there and then click on install. Let the install process run until it says 100%. and then click on open. You will sign in using your STU accounts. Use the same password for that account. Then you're signed in and ready to play. To exit Minecraft, press the escape key on your keyboard. Click OK. To locate Minecraft again, you'll need to find it in your apps launcher. And then click on this up arrow and scroll through your list of apps until you find Minecraft. There it is there. Little pro tip, if you right click a two finger tap on your tracks pad with two fingers of the same hand, I'm going to pin to shelf. This will make it for easier access and future use. Thanks. Here we are on the Minecraft download page. And right now I am on uh, a laptop. So this is what you would do to get uh, Minecraft education if you were using a laptop. So you can see the different choices here. We are going to um, choose for a Windows laptop right here where it says Windows Store version. So we don't wanna click this purple bar. We wanna click down here where it says Windows Store version. So I'm gonna click that. And then I'm gonna open Always Allow and then open app installer. So you can see here that um, this blue check mark is ch checked and we're going to launch when ready. That's what we want to do because we're going to check it out. And then right here it says install. So I'm going to go ahead and install this. So now that my app has installed, um, I get taken right into the launch screen. I'm just going to make this a little bit bigger right here and um, I am already logged in, but you will probably get a Minecraft um, prompt. So I'm just going to sign out here so we can see this. So we are going to sign in. All right, so the app has launched and I am going to sign in. And you are going to use your at OCSB student account. And since I'm a teacher, I'm going to use the at OCSB.ca. Um, Yours is at OCSB student.ca. So I'm going to click on next. And then I'm going to type in my password. This is the same password that you log into your devices with, or you check your email with your student email. So I'm going to go ahead and sign in. So now that I have Minecraft downloaded to my Windows uh, laptop, um, this is how you're going to launch it again. So here down here where you see the little magnifying glass, I'm going to just start typing in Minecraft. And then you're going to see this white window up here. And you could simply just click here or to make it even a little bit uh, easier for you to find in the future, I'm going to pin it to the taskbar 
And once I do that, I can find it down here. So that's what I'm going to do to make it a little bit easier. And then you can see it launching uh, right here.